Hello Facebook and YouTube. Welcome to the review with me John. Today I'm going to be reviewing another ramen. And this ramen is quite special because this is according to the ramenraider.com the number two best ramen of all time. And that was updated in 2017. So according to him the unequivocal rater of the most types of ramen on the internet at least this is number two of all time and this is the my koali panang spicy prawn soup noodle and i've tried the the uh the white curry from them and i thought that was pretty good um he had it as his number seven but this is number two. I haven't yet found the, the one that he has as number one. But if I do, I'll try that out as well. So here we go. Is this, pop? can this possibly be the second best ramen of all time? Uh, like the other one, you boil the noodles for three minutes. In a separate bowl, you put the, the uh, it's like a spice paste, chili paste and a soup seasoning packet which is like a powdered um, soup base both of which smelled a lot like shrimp um, this is a shrimp flavor or well, prawn flavor and the, the smell of this is very seafoody very shrimpy and then you put the noodles in the bowl you mix it up with the chili paste and the seasoning and the last step which i have not done yet and they have this little pack of fried onions. I'm supposed to open that up. Put it on the top as a topping. So these are like the French's kind of onion fried chunks. They taste really similar to them maybe with more like of an Asian flair to them but that's it I've done everything the instructions say and then it says it is ready to be served so let's go ahead and taste this let's see if it is indeed the second best ramen and by that I mean instant noodle in the world of all time As you can see it has like a nice reddish color to it. Very, very strong in the seafood smell. This is tasty. It does the the smell matches the taste very much. Shrimpy, seafoody flavor to it. The chili paste has shrimp in it, and the soup sachet has a seafood powder. Don't know what that means. So there is shrimp in the paste. And there's a seafood powder in the soup mix. Very, very oniony. I'm not. Very, very seafoody. With a very. The onion definitely gives you like a. A kick to it with a different fla flavor for profile. So that little onion packet that I put on top. When it hydrates in the soup, it does give you a nice oniony flavor throughout. And the occasional little, little crunch in your bite. It 
This is a really good ramen. <clears throat> the spice level is nice. I didn't get hiccups. I didn't start sweating anywhere. So it's not like super spicy. But you definitely feel it in the back of your mouth. Now, would I say this is number two of all time? I don't know. It is good. It's probably at least a nine and a half out of ten. But I still think I like the uh, the fire noodle flavor better than these ones. Not, not necessarily the double spice one, but the regular one. They taste really good. I do like the, the onion on top. It gives it a nice crunch. And the onion flavor really uh, balance as well with the shrimp flavor. But also I think I liked I think I liked the white curry one better than I like this one. I think it's just if I liked it because the broth was a little bit thicker. Um, with the that non-dairy creamer that they had that you add to the broth it just made it a little more unctuous, a little thicker. Stuck to the noodles. Sauce stuck to the noodles a little bit better, I think. But this is good. A spicy prawn soup noodle from my Kowali. Pretty good. If you see it in your store, I do recommend it. This one also does have... A little ramen raider emblem on it just in case you were wondering i think all the my Kuali brands ones have that emblem on it i do recommend uh, if you like ramen if you're a seafood liker you try this one out it definitely has the qualities of a spicy prawn flavor and those onion fried bits i think really are you know the cherry on top, as they say. <coughs> Excuse me. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you're enjoying all these ramen videos, then great, because I have more to do. And if you don't, I'll have some other videos as well. So don't worry too much. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. Like, share, and subscribe. And as always, enjoy yourselves. And until next time, bye.